To transition our Security Plus curriculum from social engineering to application and service attacks, I'm going to do a short demonstration of browser-based exploits using Kali Linux, Windows XP, and an older version of Adobe Flash. I'd encourage you to try this on your own, provided you follow all of your local laws. I've selected an Adobe Flash use after free vulnerability from 2015 in the Metasploit framework on Kali Linux. Show the options for that. The default port this exploit listens on is 8080. I'm going to set that port to 80. This will look like normal HTTP traffic. I'm going to set the URI path to free iPad. And this will be to use in a social engineering attack. So when the user browses to my website slash free iPad, will be malicious code that runs in the background that takes advantages of vulnerabilities in Adobe Flash and it's going to execute shell code uh, that will give me access to their computer. So when I, the user, browse to this website, um, either I just found it as I'm going through the internet or more likely I got a social engineering email a spam or other effort that directs me to this website. I click on the link, I load it. Looks like it's taking a while to load. I can see at the bottom that I'm sending them the SWF file and that is the uh, Adobe Flash file. Then I see a interpreter session opened. So you can see that the username of this system is Windows XP. I'm just going to shut down their computer from Interpreter to show that I have access to it. So that's it. If you browse to a malicious website when you have older software running or there's a zero day, uh, the adversary can gain access to your computer. And if you're using really old software, these exploits are readily available uh, as open source software on platforms like Kali Linux.